I just wanted to let y'all know I am so grateful and I am so thankful I wouldn't be able to continue on if the Lord didn't give me grace if the Lord didn't say that he would take my sins and erase thank all you guys whether or not you put me through hell or you showed me heaven Pray that the Father, pray that our Lord, pray that the God who made that tree, the one that made me, the one that created my son, who blessed me with him, pray that he blesses you and that you recognize it and you see it and you rejoice in it. And you hold on to it. And you don't let go of it. You need to put up walls today. You need to stand up today against what is against you. Stop wasting days. Stop wasting time. You ain't got that much. I don't know if most of y'all know this, but the average life expectancy is maybe 70 years for an adult male. What are you gonna do in 70 years? I'm 27 years old. I've wasted almost most of that time. I ain't gonna do that no more. I know it ain't gonna be easy. I know this, I ain't foolish. It's not gonna be easy. I ain't gonna, I'm not gonna look back at, at what he took out of me. I'm not gonna go back to that vomit and wallow in it. He took it out of me, so I ain't gotta put it back in me. I ain't trying to be like, I ain't trying to condemn anybody. I ain't trying to tell you guys that I'm perfect and I got it all together, because I don't. I'm a mess. Every day I am still struggling to, to forgive, to love, to have patience with my wife, to have patience with my children. It's a struggle, but I can't quit. I can't give in. I am so blessed and it took me so long to see it. I hope you see yours today. I hope you love yours today. I hope you take some time to actually value it. Lord, please. Please awaken the people who are still asleep. Light a fire under those who've been put out. Bring back the ones who have ran. Give strength to the tired and the weary. You have strengthened me in many areas. And I know you continue to do the same in me and many others. If you guys need to, reach out to somebody around you. There's no reason not to. There's no reason to act like what you're going through is is all about you it's not see because when you fall the people around you fall when you hurt the people around you hurt when you love you share that love when you're kind the people around you get kindness i thank the lord for this child Other, every other one out there they are his these children belong to the kingdom of Christ this life belongs to Jesus anything that is living and breathing the air in which he created belongs to him don't be forced to bow to your knees 
bow to your knees in respect. Hit your knees for forgiveness and for mercy. Do it willingly. Some of us are forced on our knees. It's not by the Lord. Don't ever think that any of us are, are where we're at because of the Lord. He does not force his will upon you. There's not one time period in my life that I can tell you guys that the Lord forced his will upon me. The devil did. Satan did. Not the Lord. He sat back, waiting until I was ready to listen. I thank him for it every day. Love you guys. And I'm praying daily that you guys will grasp this love and run with it and not ever let it go. In Jesus' name, thank you.